Hey guys, what's up? Pase Baller here. We are now uh, to discuss game number 5 of NBA Finals. That will be on June 13, 2022, 9 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time. So that's going to be June 14, uh, 9 o'clock a.m. here in Manila. I am just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our YouTube account or YouTube channel, Pase Baller. Please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on the bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications whenever new videos are uploaded. Uh, the series is now tied up at two games apiece. Uh, we were able to get uh, games number two, three, and four uh, right. Um, yeah, the only mistake that we had was game number one. But here we are now, game number five, nevertheless. Uh, the game will be at uh, uh, Golden State's home court. So obviously they do have the uh, home court advantage, but in terms of uh, the momentum and in terms of the confidence, I got to give it to Golden State as well with what they showed on their last uh, game, game number four, when they beat Boston Celtics by 10 points, 107 to 97. All right, so let's take a look at the injury list first before we proceed. Um, so I need to refresh my phone. Hold on. I don't see any injury list for Boston Celtics as well, so props to uh, the management and their and their coaching staff for uh, taking care of their players. Uh, for Golden State Warriors, it's the same thing. You know, the only list, the only player on the list that they have is James Wiseman, and we all know Wiseman has been out for the you know uh, for the entire season. So, good job for both teams. Uh, both teams are actually available. Uh, I mean. Uh, all players for both teams are actually av available, so uh, that will make the things more interesting. All right, so let's take a look at the spread. Um, not just sure if there have been any changes, but I checked on it earlier. Uh, let me just check it again. Uh, it opened up with minus three point five for the home team, Golden State Warriors, and as we speak, it is still at minus three point five. All right, to begin with, uh, the, the, the trend is still continued on game number four. When Boston won game number one, it was Golden State who won the next game, and it was Boston who won the third. It was Golden State who won the fourth game. Um, on this uh, particular game, at game number four, we saw, Bo we saw Stephen Curry exploded for 43 freaking points. And man, Stephen Curry is starting to really show who he is, starting to show what he can do. Um, I know Boston Celtics really look great and dangerous, man. A lot of play, a lot of people even, you know, even uh, thought and predicted that uh, it will be Boston Celtics <laughs> ending the series um, in five games. But I just felt like that is such um, a disrespect for Golden State Warriors, man. I know Golden State Warriors ain't the same Golden State Warriors when KD was there, you know, when they were when they were still um, uh, packed up. But man. This is still Golden State Warriors. Uh, they got Curry, they got Thompson, they got Wiggins, um, and again Curry is starting to show what he, you know, what he can do. Um, on this game number five, they will they will be back at home. Um, I, I I know the trend is actually you know Boston will win, Golden State Golden State will win, Boston will win. But um, on this game number five, I think this is actually when the trend would actually stop and Golden State would actually go with back-to-back -back wins. After winning game number four, I feel like Golden State Warriors would actually would actually win game number five. Stephen Curry, uh, Stephen Curry's confidence is you know uh, is is now at uh, is now in premier. Um, I know Boston Celtics would um, would prepare something to you know to to kind of manage what Stephen Curry would do, and uh, and Steve Kerr along with his boys are actually prepared for that. Um, anyway, he's got a lot of options um, lurking around Stephen Curry, um, you know, uh, making themselves open whenever Stephen Curry would actually hit uh, would actually get hit by the defense of Boston Celtics. Man, uh, this this game number five is really gonna be very crucial. I, f I feel like whoever wins game number five will actually win the series. And man, I have to be honest, uh, I really feel like game number five would go to Golden State Warriors. Golden State Warriors will win the game. Stephen Curry would still continue um, his his great shooting. Uh, and he will, he will be receiving enough help from his boys to get the win. In terms of the spread of minus 3.5, I think that's kind of small enough for Golden State Warriors to actually... Uh, uh, worry about <laughs> I think Golden State Warriors will win at the same time cover the spread of minus 3.5 
Game number five, my prediction, GSW, minus 3.5. Peace out, pass love, and God bless.